Hey guys, this is Mel Turco from Kifaro. Today we're going to be doing a video on our Wooby and Doobie. Uh, the Wooby and Doobie is what we like to refer to as the 21st century poncho liner. Uh, here's, here's a Wooby wrapped around me right here. Uh, I'll point out some features of uh, these guys. The, the Wooby and Doobie are about 2 inches wider and about 6 inches longer than a USGI poncho liner. Uh, it uses our proprietary Rhino Skin shell fabric. We're using Climate Shield Combat insulation. It's American made. Uh, the Wooby uses 2 ounces per square yard insulation and the Doobie is double thickness at 4 ounces per square yard insulation. I'd like to point out a couple features that make this also different than uh, here's a, a standard USGI Wooby here. You can see it's stitched down. It's not the best insulation. It's all stitched down. Our Woobies are the Climate Shield Combat insulation does not have to be stitched down only around the perimeter. So you have Shell fabric, airspace, insulation, airspace, shell fabric. So it really traps the heat and keeps you way warmer than any issue poncho liner. Another thing that's different is right here, you can't quite see it very well, but there's little paracord loops going around the perimeter of our woobies and doobies. Standard uh, GI poncho liners have the cords all the way around. There's not too many guys use these and tie into ponchos anymore, uh, but if you need them, all you need to do is get a, about one foot of paracord, run it through the loop, tie a knot, now you've got your cords if you want to use it to tie into anything. Uh, another feature uh, our Wolfing Doobie has is a sewn-in stuff sack. Uh, so it's never, you're never going to lose it and it's always there. And uh, I'll show you how it works right now. You just kind of take it, kind of take it inside out, just like this, and then you just start stuffing it in. Stuffing it in here. I'm gonna go down here now so you can see me. I just work my way in. A lot of guys, they see the Wooby or the Doobie and they, they swear it's not gonna get in that little stuff sack, but the compressibility of the Climate Shield Combat insulation is pretty amazing, actually. And as you can see here, I got it all stuffed in. There's a Wooby in its own, own stuff sack. And that doesn't tell the whole story because the Climate Shield Combat compresses so easy. And as you can see, I can just squeeze it in, 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 and just compress it really well. So that's one option for, uh, for carrying your uh, Wooby or Doobie, just stuff in his own stuff sack, and then it's pretty pliable, so you can shove it in your ruck and kind of work it in and out of opening and stuff. But if you want an even tighter package, you can use our compression stuff sacks. For a Wooby, it takes a three-string large, and a Wooby fits perfect in a three-string large. Again. Here it is right here, but you can just compress it down, 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 down to a very small package. The Doobie takes a five string small stuff sack. Fits perfect in a five string small, and here you can see a Doobie compressed. And again, you can just keep compressing that Doobie down into a very small package. So, you've got the compression stuff sacks or the sewn in stuff sack for options on, on uh, stuffing the Wooby. I uh, went over the differences between the uh, USGI poncho liner and our Wooby Doobie, and uh, I think that's about it, guys. Thanks.